look at that we made it where i actually wanted to be uh but yeah what's going on welcome back everybody hopefully you all are having a wonderful day um i'm surprised it took me that long to get to where i wanted to go it's like that was this dumbest one of the dumber things that i've done in a while i literally i walked up and i was like oh I was like, oh, yeah, we're fine. We are big chilling. And it's like, the game was like, so you are, are you? And I'm like, no, no, I'm not. It's me. I'm not. But yeah. So we caught Troy in the Frost Cavern. And yeah, let's go ahead and go over a team recap, considering this is where we caught him. But yeah, honestly, it makes the name makes sense. I like it. Okay, so let's go ahead and go over the team before we go into the crazy fight. Obviously, I am not leading off with Satan in this fight. I just don't trust it. I'm gonna go ahead and put our boys. I'm gonna put Katie in the front. That's who I that's who I trust the most right now. It's an odd trust relationship, but it's fine. We have Katie with unaware, cotton guard, sacred fire, not sacred fire, sacred sword, high jump kick, and leaf blade. We've got Satan with inner focus, shadow ball, diamond storm, dragon pulse, psycho cut. We have pin cushion cat with facade, blaze kick, fly, and horn drill. We have Sleepy with the sandwich ability with covet, ice punch, sleep powder, and sword stance. We have Terry with electric web, eerie impulse, shock wave, and charge, which I'm gonna go ahead and I actually like the boost up there. Then we got our gluttonous little Troy with foul play, sky uppercut, forest curse, and sacred fire. The ability that Troy will have if I decide to get rid of Gluttony is also unaware. So, I'm not going to use that right now. But that's not a bad option in the future, especially if our little freaking Breloom dies. So, KD, you better not die, but I, I don't want to use my ability capsule. But if we have to, we have to. It's a really cold here. Isn't it? Oh my gosh. It's almost like if I walk in with just my pure muscles and go into the cold, I'm going to be cold. This Obama snow is some fine specimen, according to my ver According to... It's according to something, whatever. According. I don't know. Reading absolutely is accordingly. But it's absolutely brimming with energy. Ugh. The more we agitate it, the stronger it becomes. It's the stronger its snow warning ability becomes. It's making the snow fall more ferociously, just like it did in Buffalo, New York. Let's catch it swiftly and get out of here. Nah, dog. We're not doing that. Hey, you Pokeball thieves, what are you doing? What does it look like we're doing? We're catching Pokemon. Why else would we be gr have grabbed all of those Pokeballs? My gosh. Uh, it's like, how could we catch powerful Pokemon like a bomb snow that's p full of potent energy without them? Energy. You're not the brightest of the bunch, aren't you? I mean, that's mm, debatable. Whoever has the most Pokemon at the and the most energy will come out on top. Lazy people who just wait for things to be handed to them don't get enough of these resources. But why is Bright Shadow amassing Pokemon and energy? I like how, okay, okay, let's talk about the fact that I'm grabbing this pillow. Like, this is not supposed to be here, but yeah, literally it has been forever. And it's just a uh, floppy pillow right now. To put it another way, why is Bright Shadow trying to take everything for itself? Allow me to spell it out for you because I just like have to. It's so that Bright Shadow and only Bright Shadow can survive. Duh. After all, why do we should we care about saving people who aren't even on our side? It's almost like we only have to save people with the same thought processes. Oh my gosh. I don't mind healthy curiosity, but I'm afraid it's just not healthy anymore. You're just thinking too much. <sighs> They said only Bright Shadow will survive. Yeah, they did, but it's fine. They got a few screws loose. You two, uh, hurry up. Send these kids packing already. Uh, right away. Yes, ma'am. Let's go, Bright Shadow. This is the trademark pose. Okay. I mean, didn't think that your manager was a total Karen, but it's fine. I mean, she got some things right, as some Karens do, but um, didn't expect her to get literally some things wrong, too. Like... I thought that the whole point was to have you every to be right in every occasion. Just like we were right on our lead. Leaf Blade, go at him. Kill this Kabutops. 
with no hesitation. We stand. We love it. Also, it is crazy to me. We don't have a fairy type move. Um, what do I? What do I? Not what do I value most, but what do I worry most here? It's dark and ghost. Honestly, we should be fine. We should be fine. We can just leave Blade again and everything it should be alright. As long as we don't use our fighting moves like dumbs, then we should be okay. It's gonna take two hits though. Uh well, I mean it's gonna do four Oh, oh my god, that did a lot. That's a Sableye. That's a problem. If a Sableye is doing that much problem or have give causing this much problem, that's not good. No bueno. And I don't think we get healed either, so that's great. That's a great hit for us to take. An unexpected lava plume that we didn't know was coming. We love it. Yikers! Oh, good. We can heal. <laughs> cool. Okay. I was like, we're not going to be able to heal. Oh, this is going to be a, pro a big, 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 big problem. Which, honestly, to be let's be honest, it probably should have been. I w the thing about some Pokemon games, it's like, they let you heal. And you're like, okay, we're fine. It's fine. We're chill. We're okay. Like, after, after playing Persona, which is, like, a different form of RPG, it's very interesting where the necessities are in line. You're more powerful than you look. Ah, I wonder how much energy you have inside you. I wonder how much energy some people have inside them, too. But, you know, we can discuss those matters because it's almost the first week of the month. Yes, uh, Tana, let's discuss some things, girl. Uh, let's discuss how I've but Oh, wait a minute. Uh, do I want to say that yet? Do I want to say that yet? Because I think that this is actually going to hit with a psychic type move. And we don't have any way to counteract that instant, instantly a problem. Um, I'm gonna go with Terry though. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, Terry is one of the. I know Terry is not very trustworthy. We have already established that Terry is probably one of the worst mods I have, which is why I feel comfortable throwing it out on a. Wow, we freaking that was even worse than that could have been. I was I was not planning for that worst case scenario, so thank God I was paying attention. Um, but I'm gonna electro web slow it down, which didn't actually matter because we're faster than this. Wow, okay, Terry. I didn't think you'd be faster than a Starmie, but okay. A special defense increase? Wow. Tana! You're not allowed to... Oh my god, Tana. Tana, 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 no. How about let's not play this game? Eerie Impulse coming in clutch today. Hopefully, watch is getting credit. It's not gonna matter, but it's fine. No, okay, good. Although crits still are gonna have the chance of mattering. And with that special defense increase, I can't risk it. I'm gonna have to push. But yeah, so Tana has a force Pokemon as well. I don't remember what it is. Again, I'm glad that I don't remember this. It's not a bad thing that I don't remember this. It's just like, I wish I remembered a little bit. But I, I, I'll, again, just like with time, I think I'll know it exactly when I see it. I knew Tana was here. That's kind of why I was messing with her and, like, playing the Karen role. Because, honestly, Tana would appreciate that more than anyone. Um, just because we, we play around and joke around about that all the time. And so she gets to play the role of it. Woo! And she got to literally slam Jonas across the floor, which is... That was completely unintentional, but okay. I'm like... That was not what it was needed to happen, but <laughs> you go, girl. Um, he didn't deserve it that much. Um, Troy's first appearance. You know, he sometimes needs to get slammed to the floor, too. I mean, it's first week of the month, y'all. It's raging season. No, I'm honestly, <laughs> I hate to say it. It's also the truth right now. Oh, my God. It is going to be a great first week of the month, y'all. You guys are going to deal with my butt. Forever. Um, wait, I mean, technically, you could hit the not subscribe button and you don't deal with that. But please don't. If anything, if it's red for you, you should, like, make it not red. Um, but, <laughs> um, yeah, so I can, uh, like, so technically on data, oh, 
technically on date of recording, we're 11 minutes away from the first week of the month. So, um, yeah, that's fun. I know, even, tr again, it's funny, Troy and I messed with each other a little bit, and he was like, just so you know, tomorrow's the last, of the, the last day of the month, hardy har, and I was like, yeah, I know, I can feel it, <laughs> quite literally, um, and that's why we were messing, okay, again, I, I, he messes with me, like, and it's fun, but, yeah, so, back to the story, we just keep joking around and having a good time, but sometimes... There are some third things that you're just like, fly what is wrong right now? Like, and it happens just generally. Like, again, and I don't know if you guys understand what I'm going to talk about, but I'm going to talk about it anyway. But, like, I don't know if you guys ever, ever, I know, like, some one person that understands, but, like, this super mundane, non trivial thing is okay for, like, most, most of the year, or most of the month, and, and then just that one specific time. You're just like, I want to kill you for doing this right now, but I have to hold all the, ra the rage within because if I <laughs> let it out, it's gone. A yeah, gone is what is going to happen, and it's, we don't want that to happen because um, I, you know, you care about the person, mo it, 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 and I feel bad because I don't know. Y'all probably understand, but the, you let it out on the person that you know the most, that you love the most, and you're just like, yeah, I'm sorry you have to deal with me. Yeah. Also, uh, by the way, uh, Charizard, uh, this is a thing. Um, I'm sure you loved seeing this move. And I'm pointing this out to you specifically. Because we were joking about Shell Smash. And then this happened. And I was like, oh, you mean a no consequence Shell Smash? Cool. We'll take it. <laughs> and it still doesn't kill. Which is actually insanity. It's not like Covet's the strongest move or anything. But, jeez, I would expect a plus two slacking to do a little bit better. Ludicolo. Poor thing. Poor Ludicolo. You are gonna get absolutely demolished. Oh, this feels so nice. It's so cold. Uh, I've been I've been letting this out to kind of be cold. Oh, oh my god, you really are about to be demolished. Um. Oh, you weren't demolished. Okay. So yeah, also the other thing we have is Ice Punch, and I used my PP up on Ice Punch, so I'm sorry y'all, but I did it anyways. Um, so yeah, again, more things you guys gotta deal with. Have a great time, y'all! But yeah, um, I, on, the level cap also was 55, but then this fight's 55, so essentially it's whatever my levels end up being by the time I reach the gym leader. Because this game likes to be super ridiculous half the, uh, most of the time. Oh, okay, this is the one type that actually gives us problems, is Fairy. I gotta stay in, but you're my main, uh, no, 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 we, we're not playing the gotta stay in game. It's a Sylveon, right? Yeah, no. So we got Troy, who's a resistance. So here's our options. We have Troy, who's a resistance to Fairy. Or we have Pincushion Cat. And we can hope that Pincushion Cat murders the thing. Those are my two best options, in my opinion. Because it's not defensive, I'm going to play the game of Troy. Because Troy's a... But tr the thing is, is Troy also doesn't have much in the way of physically attacking moves that are good against fairy but we do have the forest curse sacred fire combination which i'm going to utilize right now and see kind of what this sylveon wants to do because basically so uh, grassy grassy whatever grassy pledge um forest curse is supposed to be my scout turn and in my scout turn i end up getting a uh 100% boost in my damage. So, it's it does work wonders because the scout turn literally mean means nothing. Um because I'm making my damage increase by 100%, which means it's going to do double damage. So, like again, I'm it's a positive. Uh, that's not critical hit, please. 
So it is a very important kind of sequence of events, and it has to be done in that order. But that's the way, like, and especially, oops, sorry, especially when you consider the fact of, hey, you don't want to use, you have 5 PP on this move. You want to do as much damage as possible. So that's something I was thinking about making my uh, PP up on. But I also feel like, I felt like Troy was higher chance of death. Doesn't battling with Bright Shadows scare you? I'll admit it, it scares me and I don't like battling them. But we managed to protect Obama Snow by pitching in there. I know I'm the reserved type and I'm okay with that. Well, some people are. But it's okay to be important, bold, when necessary. Oh my gosh. My Amazon doesn't have to worry about Obama Snow anymore. And that's what matters. You're so wrong in so many ways. All as well that ends well, right? That's not a Jonas line. I feel like that's totally not a Jonas line. Hey, hey, Obama Snow. Thank you for the Obama night. Can you be on my team? I feel like you do Actually, no, you wouldn't do good for me. I feel like you'd do great for me. No, you wouldn't. Unless you have Wonder Guard. And then if you had Wonder Guard, you would be fine. But you don't. So. Sammy. You don't do that. Unless you become a shiny. And then that. Although, this is probably where I'll start grinding for my uh, levels. I was almost stupid. Um. Yeah, this might be where I start grinding for levels because a shiny Sammy would be lovely. I'd freak out over a sh like, I wouldn't be able to speak at all. I'd be like, ah, no, I have, I'd have to have another silent episode, guys, and that was supposed to be a gimmick episode. So, frick. I was almost stupid. Damn it, Sammy! You got me. You made me stupid. You made me commit a stupid, and I'm not happy with you, especially because we have to find a freaking Pokemon that we had to deal with that murdered us. Sammy! Oh. Oh. Oh, Frostlass. You just committed your death sentence. Come on out, my lovely Sleepy. <sighs> Honestly, I don't know why I sent in Troy, or why I didn't send in Troy. But it's fine. Go to sleep. <laughs> we'll just uh, hit this thing with uh, ice, whatever, ice punches, because we can. Did we put the safety goggles on, or did were we actually getting hit? <gasps> oh my god, wait, Sand Rush actually makes us immune to the sand. Oh, Charizard. Oh no, I really do need a sand setter. Oh no, Charizard! I didn't. Re I forgot about that part of Sand Rush. I, I honestly did. I was like, I need the safety goggles for this. I need to put it on him so he doesn't get buffeted by the sand, and it'll be okay because we love him, and he's so amazing, and he's sweepy, and he needs it. My gosh, if I could actually <laughs> just do that, I can actually. Oh no. Oh, Sleepy, you're gonna die. <laughs> you're 100% gonna die to chat. But hey, I mean, that protects Garatina for longer, so that's fine. It's totally okay if we're protecting Garatina for longer. It was definitely, yeah. I was not. <laughs> I didn't know that happened. I didn't know how that happened. I didn't know that worked that way. <laughs> Wait, does it say it in the thing? And I just didn't read it. No, it literally just says boost the stats in a sandstorm. It doesn't say anything. But wait, boost the boost speed in a sandstorm. It doesn't say anything about immunity to sand. Well, I didn't anticipate having immunity to sand. Okay, go on, yo. Um, again, I'm okay with not anticipating that because that was an, a wel warm, welcoming surprise that we got to witness. So I'm cool with it. As long as y'all are, y'all have to, because it's how it works. But wow, I just not what I was ready for at all. Like legitimately, that's that's amazing. Mammoth swine's gone. 
You know what we gotta do? I actually don't. But I hope y'all know what we gotta do, because, yeah. My guess is we're meeting, like, people. Like, not in Anastar, because we're not quite there yet, right? But we have a joy fight coming up. We have a... Oh, or, oh, wait, 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 wait. Is the mamma... Do we have to go to the Frost Cavern to free the mamma swine so that the mamma swine can take us to the, uh, the area? That might be what's going on. Well, if that's the case, we should get our encounter here before we head out and do that. So... If memory serves, that's what that's what's going to go on. Okay, can we not? Can we stop sending things out that are like absolutely here to or sent out to freaking murder KD out of his freaking living room? I I don't want KD to die. Okay, that's like not what needs to happen here. Also, why did that do so much? Excuse me? Random things are just taking so much and taking all the heat. It's just like, oh yeah, it's fine. I am okay. I am not like about to die or anything. I'm just like totally fine. It's Toast my goat. I'm just like, it shouldn't have been, but okay. I guess it was. It really shouldn't have, but if you want to play it that way. Huh. We got Troy. Troy, I'm, I hate that Troy's a fallback this early. Like, Troy shouldn't be a fallback already, but he kind of is. And I, uh, that scares me that a new addition is already coming into play this much. I mean, I don't think this, this is going to be a 2 KO. This is not going to be a 3 KO because it is a Chandelure with War of Time. That's about to crit and kill Troy. Damn yeah, I mean, it crit. It didn't kill Troy, but it crit. So at least he called one of the things. I had a feeling. Yeah, I just had the cr the crit feeling. Also, it's first week of the month now, so uh, um, sorry, had to do that, and you guys probably are like, oh god, why'd you do that? But it's fine, it's fine, it's chill. If that was anything but chill. But okay, you go, you go, do your thing. Um, but yeah, hi, Troy, again, Troy being a fallback, not a good thing. Should have learned from that experience. Um, okay. The Lost Hotel. The encounter in the Lost Hotel is... There it is. Our lost hotel encounter is a. It's an Oogle Blip. <laughs> it's an Oogle Blip! No! He lied! He was lost! He found his way home! Oogle Blip! What are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh! Of course, we find Oogle Blip in the lost hotel! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Almost like it's freaking this thing dies. He's <laughs> probably back on the team. Oh my god, he's actually named Google Blip. I don't even have to name him. <laughs> I didn't even I didn't even catch that. He just automatically flipped in my head and my heart that I just <laughs> Oh no! Okay. Okay, Google Blip. <laughs> I don't have to name you. It's fine. Oh my God, Google Blip, we love you. D joy love you too. We're 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 working on the joy love. Cause joy love is some of the most important love. Okay, Google Blip, you gotta understand that the joy loves, and even if it's brotherly and sisterly love, as Joy and I have, um. It's like, it hits different, okay? 
You're a quirky, scrappy boy. With side strike, because of course you already have a busted move! Oh, the Oogle Blip. I swear. Oogle Blip's gonna also learn Surf or something stupid. <laughs> oh my god, Oogle Blip, you mad man. You're... You take plenty of... Oh my god, you are... You literally are, Oogle Blip. You... We're in the lost hotel because you were lost after you died to the Electivire. The lost hotel is literally supposed to be meant for Rotom, by the way. Um, so the whole point of it is that Rotom had, like, died and resided in the lost hotel. It's quirky and takes plenty of siestas. This, this is literally the perfect Google blip. And... Yeah, like, okay. Wow. That's, that's insane. Of course, only a Google Blip would do that, but... Oh, oh, wait, excuse me. Let me go grab that real quick before it directs me that I don't. Okay, so yeah, yeah, yeah. So Route 17 is next. Goes from Route 15 to 17. That kind of triggers me, but... But Route 16's got to be somewhere, and I just didn't catch it. Unless the, it becomes Route 16, that pro actually that would make more sense, but we'll find out. Route 17. Yeah, I'm not stupid. Good job. Oh no, no Route 16 is the strike covered thing. That the menagerie that is that area. That's right. Okay. The area that really, honestly, nobody really goes to in Nuzlocke. It's, it's one of those areas, which is fine and dandy, but it's like when you're not expecting it, you're like, uh... Okay, our encounter is... Oh. Okay, I'll take it. Also, what is Katie asleep for? Oh, grass whistle. Why did Katie fall asleep? Well, luckily, we don't need Katie right now. Um, if anything, we actually need Sleepy, so... And... This should hurt Sleepy. The hail should hurt Sleepy. If it doesn't, I'll be scared for Sleepy's life. Yeah, there you go. Buffeted by the hail. So yeah, so it's, it, I'm only immune to the sand. That makes sense. Kind of. Oh, also Sleepy is my catching mon. I didn't even catch that. Whoops. Uh, whoops. <laughs> Bye, man. I didn't think you are going to get take that much damage. Unless you somehow survive, which I don't think you will. Bye, Mantine! Whoops! The hail kills another thing. Um, honestly, the hail is my worst nightmare. It's my enemy right now. And Nuzlocke, in real life, I actually like the hail. Um, I actually, I have a, a fond and kind of vivid memory of, uh, during Lothlock, actually, number one, I got super mad because, like, we couldn't complete it and all this stuff. In hindsight, it made more sense, but I was just like, what the heck? I'm this, I'm literally planning on staying at his house, I'm planning on being here, and blah blah blah. I was a, a mess because, uh, and I was, I was pretty rude, not gonna lie, and I shouldn't have been. But, oh my god, Kitty's about to die. Uh, but, anyways, I had, was talking about it, and there was a bunch of different things, and I was so mad that I went out and I was trying to talk to him and communicate with him about what's going on with Mudlock, why Mudlock isn't going to happen um, for the month of March. And I was talking to him in the pouring hail about how this is what's going on, and this and that and the other, and we're going to have to postpone it. I don't even know if we're going to have to be able to do it, but I really want to do it. And this is like our only opportunity that we're going to have to do it because everything's going to open up in a couple weeks anyway. And so it's... 2020 happened and it didn't but so it all ended up working out in the end we still got to do it we still got to be the first people to do that and how, like just like how i'm going to be the first person to do an eight generation nuzlocke and i mean actually do I, i'm not going to announce it but maybe i'll be the first person to do a nine generation nuzlocke um not confirming or denying i don't know that yet it, apparently gen nine is a, a heck hole and is pretty bad according to a lot of people 
that scares me. So, I haven't purchased it yet, I'll be honest. Because, again, everybody's like, it's bad. And I'm like, okay, I want to create it for content, but also, I'm like, do I also, do I want to deal with the potential consequences that I don't know about yet? No. Because, again, I don't know the consequences. I don't know what I'm going to get myself into, and that scares me. Uh, but then again, I'm always scared of all that. The random stuff that I'm scared of. Um, so, yeah. So, I actually don't mind the hail. It's wind that I hate. It's wind that I cannot stand, okay? Like... Y'all know that I had a tree literally almost fall on my face while I was sleeping, so I don't like the wind. Um, you know, <laughs> it just happened to be that way. So, luckily, the A-frame, like, it went like this. It was an A-frame house, so, you know, the A-frame house was like this, and it went like this. And if the A-frame house didn't collapse the way, like, if it collapsed any differently, I wouldn't be here today. So, clearly, there's a reason for me to exist. Um, I still haven't figured that out, but, you know, we're fine. It's chill. Um, wow, we, yeah, so we made it to Anastar. That's perfect, actually, because then I can do the Joy fight and the uh, Susan fight for the next episode. And speaking of Joy, hey, next time we challenge, I challenge you, it'll be in front of the YouTube Yagus's Gym prepare yourself honestly i won't ever be prepared because i don't like fighting you because i like it's again it's more the fun brotherly sisterly like ha i'm gonna beat you today kind of thing rather that's why i love when we do like arcade log was fun because it was you could tell it was like i want to win i want to do this but also do i really care not necessarily but i also do because we're having fun and we're doing our thing i came in place of dexio to tell you something there's a person here in Anastar City who knows about the legendary Pokemon, just so you know. Oh, I almost forgot. I brought you some gifts here. Please put them to good use. Uh, have Pokeballs that catch things you already caught before. No. You can catch things for better natures, individual IVs, and all that other stuff. That would be great if it's not enough luck. But yeah, we're in the YouTube Yagus. Hopefully y'all have a wonderful day, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!